happy to see my father and as usual the squad is still in his house waiting to torture me so that I wouldn't want to come back so they wouldn't have to move out when my father went for his afternoon nap when he got to a creeper behind my back creepy cutter creepy creepy cutter pulling my hair out with a pair of pliers creepy cutter creepy creepy cutter I was just a little boy and creepy was fresh out of jail A burglar A pedophile A drug dealer And a touchy feeler Creepy cutter Creepy, creepy cutter You've got my father's half-brother's daughter pregnant Underage, he was afraid of him. I rang where my father was in management, but he couldn't give him a job because of his criminal record. Because of his criminal record, creepy cutter, creepy, creepy cutter, na 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 creepy cutter, creepy, creepy cutter, ha 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 ha. The day of Mrs. Morrison's murder, I was told to run for the bus, but the bus I was told to run for was deliberately wrong. It didn't go across the alley and the bridge. It was all a plan from the Cutter and Caffrey family. They were after my children's policy. They were after my father's house, his stocks and shares and bank and building society accounts. So I got off the bus and started to walk Then I noticed a car full of men watching me passing them Halfway across the bridge I noticed two men approaching It was Duffy and Milligan Milligan shouted You'll not get away this time and laughed and climb through the stanchions to the roadside It was Sunday as usual There were no cars about I scurried along the ground So they couldn't see which way I went And ran as fast as I could To the other end In front of the first car that appeared It was Mrs. Morrison I tried again, I told her they're trying to kill me again She said, who are Duffy and Milligan in from the side? I said, they are She said, I know you and you You both drinking our blood You should be ashamed of yourself Little boy, can't you see he's terrified? He's only a child. Hilligan shouted at the top of his voice like a demon. It's paid for. Mrs. Morrison said, Take me instead. She was so disgusted. She knew we were both as good as dead and told to run instead. And don't look back and don't forget what I've done for you. I'm down to Southwick Queen, they're still chasing after me. I'm in the long run, in the front of the old ground, behind the old shops now pulled down. When they passed in the car that I saw When I got off the bus They were with the rest of the gang Stop on Benali, Graham and Buddy And the 
rest of the gang all crammed in like sardines in a gin can in one car. You know who you all are. You cowards, you murderers of Mrs. Morrison. Run straight to Southwick Green Police Station. I rang for help and a sergeant came and he sat me down. He made me a cup of tea with too much sugar in. I told him what had happened and he laughed. He said, I'll give you a lift home and he told my aunt to not go by. Better not report them. For they'll only try to murder him again They're all cowards They're only after money Even with the murder of Mrs. Morrison The papers said it was suicide What did the papers try to hide? The papers said it was suicide What did the papers try to hide? A cover up by the police for some Freemason families, that's what's going on. Mrs. Morrison was murdered by Duffy and Milligan, and the Cutters and Caffrey, Curry Boys and Van Alley, and they all had a hand in the murder of Mrs. Morrison, who's a hero to me. Now she's free.